Hello everyone and welcome to SummerSlam Predictions. I'm Slim, joined as always by Joe. Hello Joe. Good day. And joined by Seth, the fat boy. Hello Seth. Hi. So we'll kick things off with the Raw Tag Team Championship match between the Street Profits and Andrade and Angel Garza with Zelina Vega. Who do you have, Joe, and why? Uh, I guess the Street Profits. Profits? Any reason? Yeah. Uh, nah. Yeah. Um, no idea. All right. Seth? Profits. Profits. Any reason? Uh, they bring the swag. Okay. I'm going with Andrade and Angel Garza because if they don't win the belts here, they should just not be a team. Uh, moving on to the WWE Championship match, and it's between Drew McIntyre and Randy Orton. Who do you have, Joe, and why? Uh, Randy Orton. Randy Orton. All right. Seth? Uh, Drew, because it's Drew. Well, I get the tiebreaker and I pick Orton because I have heard that Orton's winning the belt so that Drew can win it back at some point so that now that they've got fans back, they can have a big pop for when he wins it, which was missing at uh, WrestleMania. But we'll move on to the US Championship match between Apollo Crews and MVP. Bobby Lashley and Shelton Benjamin are both banned from ringside, so it's MVP by himself. Who do you have, Joe, and why? Uh, I guess Apollo Crews. I reckon they'll just defend. Alright. Seth? I'm going with Crews because he's a better wrestler. Alright. I'm going Apollo Crews as well because he's only just won the title, sort of. Yeah, sort of, because MVP sort of had it, sort of didn't. But if we should just end the rivalry here so MVP can go off and do something else. Uh, moving on to the street fight between Dominic Mysterio with his father, Ray, versus Seth Rollins with his disciple, Murphy. Who do you have, Joe, and why? Hmm. Uh, tricky one. Uh, I'll go for... Uh... Yeah, I guess the uh, Rollins. Rollins? Any yeah. reason? Uh, yeah, not sure. Uh, I reckon Mysterio is pretty good, but yeah, yeah. Rollins. Seth, who do you have? Uh, I have Dominic, even though I know Rollins is probably going to win. Well, I've got Dominic because it doesn't make sense for Rollins to win since Rollins took Ray's eyes out at Extreme Rules. So yeah, Dominic very should, real life. Yeah. So Dominic should win to get payback. But we'll move on to the Raw Women's Championship between Sasha Banks, who might have Bailey with her, might not, who knows, versus Asuka. Who do you have, Joe? And why? Uh, I got for Banks. Sasha? How about you, Seth? Yeah. Um, I'm going to go with Asuka because she has a better chance of winning the first match than she has the second. Sasha Banks is the second match. She's facing Bailey first. Well, whichever one. Okay. Well, I'm going with Asuka because Sasha Banks is on SmackDown and shouldn't have the Raw Women's title, so Asuka should win that one. Um, and I guess that it sort of goes... Well, it doesn't really. It, it's pretty much the opposite to how it should work, but moving on to the SmackDown Women's Championship match, and it's Bailey with Sasha, maybe, versus Asuka. Who do you have, Joe, and why? Uh, I guess it's Bailey. Bailey? So you've got both of them defending. All right, yeah, then. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, Seth? Well, I mean, I've already stated that she's probably not going to win the second match. Yeah, right, so you're going Bailey. Yeah. All right, well, I'm going Bailey because I get the feeling that Bailey's going to have Sasha's help to win, and then that'll be what costs Sasha because Bailey will try to help her win but will fail, and Asuka will take the belt, and that'll nearly split them up because they'll be splitting up very soon. 
Uh, we'll move to the Universal Championship match between Braun Strowman and the Fiend Bray Wyatt. Joe, who do you have and why? Uh, I go for Strowman. Braun, any reason? No particular reason, I reckon. Just... Alright. Seth? Uh, I'm going with The Fiend because it's The Fiend and Braun's going to lose it anyways. I'm going The Fiend because it's The Fiend and The Fiend should always win. Uh, so we'll move to the last oh. match on the card and it's a hair versus hair match and it's Mandy Rose versus Sonya Deville. Joe, who do you have and why? Uh, well, I've got no idea who either of them are but I'm just going to take a guess on Rose. Rose? Alright then, Seth. Rose, because I assume Otis will do something. Well, I'm going to say Rose, because she's already had a haircut. Um, it's Sonya's turn to have her haircut now. So that's why I'm picking Mandy Rose to win that. But that is all the matches that have been announced on the card. If there's any more, I'll just put them in the comments or the description or something. But I don't think there will be any more added, if I'm being honest. I think they'll add more to Payback, which is next week. But other than that, um, that'll be it for this predictions video. So Joe and Seth, say goodbye. Bye. So, I guess I have to thank Seth for coming because he's a guest. So there you go. Um, but stay tuned to the channel. Next week there will be two more predictions videos out followed by another one the week after. But other than that, goodbye and good night.